Damian Lewis from Prep Sports Nation here at South Cobb High School in Austell, Georgia. Boys varsity soccer action as the season winds down. It's the Osborne Cardinals who have been having one heck of a season on the road at the South Cobb Eagles. Now, South Cobb looking to close out and pick up their second straight win. Meanwhile, Osborne looking to bounce back after having their eight game win streak snapped by River Ridge earlier in the week. But in this one, it would be a stellar second half for the Cardinals. Four goals in that half as they picked up the 4 0 win. Let's check out some of the highlights. Picking up action in the first half, and despite being down three starters, Osborne really controlling the pitch throughout the period. Here, Alexis Gutierrez gets one through to Salton Musa. Musa can't quite get there before Miguel Sanchez. Santos for the Eagles comes up with the save and then later it's going to be Daniel Camargo taking a shot and Santos up high for the save and again Cardinals really getting the looks Gutierrez here with the shot but it's high Santos tips it as it goes off the cross but in the second half just under a minute into the period everything starts clicking for the Cardinals Eagles trying to clear it, but they can't and Osborne Samuel Haracha his shot Taps in off the post for the goal. Osborne takes the one nil lead. Later on, Cardinals set up for the corner kick. It's in, and Oswaldo Lopez Munoz with the header for the goal. And the Cardinals up 2-0. And then Munoz would not be done here. Santos with the cross, and Munoz takes the shot and scores. 3 nil lead for the Cardinals. Munoz, his second goal of the night. And then another corner for Osborne. Everybody dancing around in there. Eagles trying to clear, but Daniel Rio sneaks it in for the goal. Osborne goes on to pick up the 4-0 win. Got to feel good to get back in the win column, coach. Absolutely, this was a big one. Okay, a little setback on Tuesday after a massive result for us on uh, previous Friday winning a region championship. So to be expected to see these guys respond like that, come out tonight, stay patient, stay disciplined, and. It really unleashed in the second half. It was really good to see heading into a big matchup next Friday uh, against Hillgrove and, and preparation for the state tournament. All right, and, and speaking of, you know, again, like you said, uh, that first half there, you guys had looks. You got the shots that you, you obviously wanted, um, but obviously just wasn't connecting. What was the biggest difference, would you say, in that second half to turn things around? Because, I mean, you guys came out immediately within the first minute to score, and then from there it was just all downhill for you guys. No, I mean, it's, it's been like that for us in a lot of games this year creating not quite getting the finish in the first half but what I've been really pleased at with these guys is they just they stayed patient they stayed disciplined stuck to our game plan possession and the goals will come uh, soccer's a funny game sometimes it's hard to put them away their keeper made some big saves in the first half to his credit um, yeah that that early one in the second half was critical to kind of get us confidence and and uh, you know put the game away all right, so once again, that final score, Osborne picking up the 4 0 win over South Cobb, getting back in the win column and getting a little momentum as they get ready for the postseason from South Cobb High School in Austell, Georgia. I'm Damian Lewis for Press Sports Nation.